In a 2010 survey of 200 companies, 76% said they had never officially declared an IT disaster. Now, considering the consequences of downtime, most executives would not consider a mere one in four chance of system failure comforting. Especially as most companies say they can't tolerate more than four hours of downtime. So, how do you develop a disaster recovery plan that will deliver a complete service or system recovery in line with your business goals? It's going to have to be based on snapshot and replication technology, not tape. With snapshots and replication, local recovery becomes instantaneous, and in the case of a major disaster, site failover can be quickly achieved. The speed depends to a large degree on the automation of the DR plan execution to eliminate delays and human error. Equally critical is the DR solution architecture. Can it deliver the most recent version of the system immediately, or will it need to assemble the bits and pieces? An adequate DR plan will need to be tested frequently. Your IT environment has probably changed since this video started. Unless the recovery solution incorporates change and automatically tests the effects of changes, common sense tells you it will fail. Here's the problem. Most DR plans today fail to meet recovery time objectives. Most DR plans are not up to date with changes. Most companies run DR tests only once or twice a year. They're costly and time-consuming. Most DR tests fail the first time. If this sounds like your situation and you're having issues with DR planning and testing, don't wait. Let us help you automate.